Okay, we're going to see. We're going to see the space here in the kitchen. This space, the kitchen cabinet, the sitting here. We remove them. We actually remodeling the kitchen, but you can see here. There is a space that I would like to seal with silicone to avoid any water damage to go and leak in this space and eventually they will leak to the ceiling below. So I'm going to seal it with a silicone. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to clean it with a, with a vacuum cleaner. That's the first thing we need to do. I'm going to use this uh, silicone almond color. You see it here? And I'm going to pull it in this instrument. Now I'm going to pull in this instrument, you can see. And I'm closing it with that. Okay, and I'm going to cut it with this utility knife, 45 degrees. Or even. So after it's cut, usually what we need to do is to remove it again. There is, you can see that one. We need to punch, punch a hole inside. Okay, we punch a hole, put it back, and we're going to put it in the instrument. You can squeeze the tube with the silicone out. So let me show you what I'm doing. So now what you see, I'm going to do it. I'm going to put it here in the space using the gun. Okay, after I use it. So now I'm going to use these, these two tools I purchased in one of these home improvement. I think it's uh, Lowe's actually. And instead I'm going to use my finger, I'm going to use these tools to smooth the silicone to his space. Let me show you how I'm doing it. I'm going to use 45 degrees. Let's get take and remove all the excess of the silicone. So I put again on the other one. And that's it. It's done. I will continue using it to put silicone to the other space that you see here. Using this tool, I don't need to use my finger. And it's going to look very professional. So this is the end result of the ceiling in the space between the floor and the wall of the kitchen. So it's very important to seal the spaces because if you have a water leak, you don't want water to go between the spaces because you will find that after this water is going to go to the ceiling under this kitchen. So if you have, if you see that any leak up and will come to the floor of the kitchen, you will see it, you will notice it immediately, and then you can take care of it. So you should use these tools that you see here. It's called Procock, and you can buy it from Home Depot or Lowe's. It's very, it's very easy to use, very effective, and the results are real professional. And I'll let you know what I use here because you can see two colors. Really in the critical places where the sink is, where the sink is, I use, you can see it, I use this kind of silicone.
okay, which is expensive silicone, it's pure silicone. And for the places that are not critical, I use this silicone, which is kind of product of Home Depot. And it's really of course like 20% uh, of the other silicone. But it's effective but not effective like the, like the other silicone. So that's it. Thank you very much.